What is up YouTube? Clickwood here back again with another Madden 15 Ultimate Team video and guys what we're going to be doing today is taking a look at the brand new Aaron Rodgers Football Outsiders item that was added to the game today. It's only going to be in packs for 24 hours. Pretty awesome card guys. You could definitely make the case that this is the best quarterback in the game and that's kind of what I want to talk about a little bit today. I will also be opening some packs at the end of this video to try and open up this Aaron Rodgers. I did get the Sammy Watkins a couple of weeks ago so maybe my luck will be back to being good again and maybe I can get this Aaron Rodgers today we'll see it's hard to know but uh, we'll give it a try here today on this video so what I want to really talk about today is the Aaron Rodgers item which as you can see here is currently going for roughly 500,000 coins a couple people have it a little overpriced here but uh, the cheapest one on the auction block at the moment here on PlayStation 4 is at 500,000 coins very awesome item, guys. I'm going to quick rotate through some of these attributes for you guys to see here. 84 speed, 86 acceleration. So it's definitely a mobile quarterback, which is something that a lot of the higher overall items are not at this point. So that's definitely something to take a look at. 84 speed for a quarterback is pretty good. Now, he's not going to be like the Michael Vick or anything like that. He's not going to have RG3 type moves or anything like that. But he's actually pretty solid here at some of the other, uh, I, uh, the other attributes with the ball in his hand so I actually kind of think that he's better than most people would think that he would be as far as mobility goes but then you look at the important attributes here obviously throwing power at 97 that is pretty beastly it's not the best in the game but I mean what so it goes up two better for a couple items and other than that it's the best quarterback I don't think you're ever going to be like oh he just doesn't have the arm to get the ball there with a 97 throw power so that's certainly acceptable 96 throw accuracy if you guys are unaware EA actually put out a blog recently that revealed that throw accuracy the attribute throw accuracy doesn't matter so I don't know why they even show it in here it's just kind of confusing and and frankly it pisses me off they should put it at zero because it doesn't matter uh, but I don't know why they do it. I, I really, I couldn't even give you an explanation as to why they do that. But uh, these are the attributes that matter here. Your throw accuracy, short, medium, and deep. Those three attributes are the ones that are actually going to affect where the ball goes. And then obviously your throw on the run and your play action uh, will be the thing that kind of fakes out the defense when you do run those play action passes. So uh, he's very good in all of these attributes. There's really nothing to complain about. 90s and everything basically. Uh, but what I wanted to do is compare him to the Peyton Manning. Like I said, the primetime Peyton Manning that came out a couple of weeks ago. Uh, I still think that you could certainly claim that Peyton Manning is the best quarterback quarterback in the game he's 97 overall so it's you know it's hard to really uh, make uh, much of a comparison between these two items Rodgers being a 95 overall but the thing is though is that Aaron Rodgers is definitely more mobile now it's funny because the Peyton Manning when that item came out I was kind of laughing that they gave him I think what yeah 75 speed I have it pulled up here on another screen uh 75 speed for Peyton Manning and that is just ridiculous. There's no way Peyton Manning at any point in his career has been 75 speed. I mean, that's like linebacker speed. Now, low-end linebacker, obviously. Uh, but, I mean, come on. 75 speed for Peyton Manning? The dude hardly ever moves. Ama Don't get me wrong. Amazing pocket presence. Amazing. Probably the best pocket presence ever of any quarterback. But... The speed is not there for Peyton Manning, but even still, Aaron Rodgers is nine speed faster. He also has better acceleration at an 86 to a 75, so he's certainly more mobile than Peyton Manning. He also has better attributes, like I mentioned, with the ball in his hand as far as like actually you know, making jukes and things like that, although he's not spectacular in any of those things, and he's actually only a 65 carrying, so if you are going to try and run with this Aaron Rodgers item, please be sure to cover up or slide because otherwise you're going to be fumbling quite a bit. And then uh, the actual pass accuracy and those attributes, um, Peyton Manning, I think, is better overall. Obviously, he has the uh, the uh, 99 accuracy as far as, you know, your short and your mid, whereas Aaron Rodgers is down here at the 95 and the 90 for those attributes. So it is a fairly significant difference there. Uh, and then, of course, the deep, they're about the same. Aaron Rodgers is at a 92, Peyton Manning is at a 93, but... Aaron Rodgers actually has the 97 throw power, whereas Peyton Manning has 95 throw power. So there is a difference there. And I think that Aaron Rodgers is, I mean, he's not going to be quite as accurate as Peyton, 
but I certainly think for most people that Aaron Rodgers probably is the better overall item because people like to run with their quarterback. We love to run read options in this community for whatever reason. I don't know what it is. Uh, and we love to just take the ball and run like designed QB runs with our quarterbacks. It's just something that we've done for years now as far as Madden goes, ever since Mike Vick came onto the scene and, and possibly even before that, you know, with your Tecmo Super Bowls and those games when you'd run around with uh, Randall Cunningham, guys like that. So, you know, we just have this entrenched idea that we should be running with our quarterbacks. And for some people like myself, it's actually fairly hard to use just a pure pocket passer because we don't have that versatility and the ability to really attack the defense in multiple ways. So that's why my opinion is that Aaron Rodgers overall is the better quarterback than Peyton Manning. Now, I actually, uh, I was going to tell you guys a little story about this while I open up some packs here. Um, I actually today had a discussion. It was kind of odd that we had this discussion, but uh, one of my friends was on a radio show today and he was talking about, well, it was a political radio show, but uh, he and the hosts were talking about who the best quarterback in the NFL was. And he was saying that he thinks that it's probably Aaron Rodgers and Peyton Manning might be the only guy who's better than him. And I'm like, hmm. Um, to me, Peyton Manning, I don't see how anybody can make a claim right now is not the best quarterback in the league. The dude is out of control. He's putting up just ridiculous numbers. So to me, I, I personally think that Aaron Rodgers, although he's putting up amazing numbers as well, they're not quite what Peyton's putting up in the touchdown total and the yardage total. So to me, I'm going to go with Peyton Manning as far as being the best quarterback in the NFL today, but uh, let me know what you guys think in the comments section below. Let me know, who do you think is the better quarterback for this game right now? Is it Aaron Rodgers or Peyton Manning? And then who is the actual better quarterback in the NFL? Very interested to hear that because I, I think it's kind of the opposite. I think Aaron Rodgers is better in the game. Peyton Manning's better in real life at the moment. But again, both players are absolutely amazing, and it really depends on what you're looking for for your team. So uh, let's take a look at some of these items here. The first thing that we get... First pack, we get Martavis Bryant, 84 overall. This is a nice item, guys. I'm telling you, I've, I looked at this thing before. Um, just to give you guys a quick spoiler, I am actually going to be putting out a, um, a budget series episode for your wide receivers here in the coming days. So be on the lookout for that, and you'll probably be seeing some uh, pretty nice receivers. I did definitely look at this one as well. So I'm happy to get this in the first pack. That's pretty beast. Uh, I don't know exactly how much he's going for at the moment, but I know it's pretty solid. So pretty happy about Martavis Bryant. That's that's a nice pull for the first pack. No complaints here from me. Hopefully we can open up something else here. I, I would absolutely love to open up that Peyton Manning. If I get that Peyton Manning, I am going to do a review on him for you guys, an actual full gameplay and everything review on him but I'm not expecting to get him. Oh, there we go. Brian Arakpo. That's actually a pretty solid item as well. Oh, that's our gold for this. That's This is not bad. This is not starting off bad at all. If uh, if I didn't have a few elite items on my team right now, I would certainly start this Brian Arakpo. This thing has nice attributes. 84 speed, 90 strength, 90 block shed, and uh, there's there's really not a whole lot to dislike about Brian Arakpo. So I definitely, uh, I definitely like where this is going so far. Two solid items to start the pack openings here today, guys. We're going to do five packs. So that was uh, pack number one and pack number two. Here's pack number three. And if you guys can hear my dog barking outside, I apologize. Another foot or, uh, team of the week item. Desmond Bryan. I almost said football outsiders item. That's pretty nice. We have three solid pulls to start this thing off. I don't know that I've made my money back yet on it or anything, but... Hey, uh, I mean, as long as we're we're coming close, that's that's okay. I'm I'm definitely cool with just opening up packs because it's just fun to open up packs, as you guys, as I'm sure all of you that play Ultimate Team know. There's just there's just like some weird rush that we get when we open up these packs. So, oops, I didn't mean to do that, guys. Sorry about that. Um, but yeah, we'll we'll open up two more packs here, and then uh, that will be the end of today's video. So, yeah, I don't know. Uh. Okay, so uh, first item that we get is that isn't very good is the William Moore, but still 82 overall, not particularly bad. Sorry about this, guys. If you hear that call sound in the background, that's because my friends are calling me on Skype. I apologize. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, so William Moore, we get that item. I'm, I'm interested, like I said, to hear what you guys think. Is it Peyton Manning? Is it Aaron Rodgers? Or is there another quarterback out there that you think is the best quarterback right now? Is it Tom Brady, possibly? I don't know. Really thinking, uh, oh, oh, that that like bluish color gets you so excited, and then you open up a Justin Blaylock, and it's like, okay, 
Come on now. So, anyways, that is going to do it for this pack opening, guys. Let me know in the comment section below if you enjoyed the video. If you did, please be sure to hit that like button. And if you're new to the channel, also hit that subscribe button. I would greatly appreciate it. That's how we grow this thing. So, thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Good luck opening Peyton Manning. I wasn't able to get him, but I did open up some other cool stuff, so I'm pretty happy about that. Thank you guys again, and I will talk to you beautiful bitches again soon.